especially when you're working in Europe, you work incrementally. You work from a small piece into a larger piece, and uh, it gradually it becomes the urban environment. But in China, it works on the other way around. Usually when you deal with urban projects, uh, it's usually way out of size, and uh, you have to do it fast as well. The scale is way too big. So when we um, actually starting to face the urbanization of China and we resulting in some of the really big problems in the urban environment, and that's when we shifted away into the rural areas. We also believe that a good urbanization for the Chinese um, is actually based on a very well developed rural area or the countryside. We are developing not only just buildings into the countryside for the older generation or you so called the very young generation. We're trying to bring life back into the countryside. We design like um, uh, contemporary um, buildings with the contemporary programs try to attract people from the urban environment back into the countryside. We want to give them identities, we we'll create buildings with identities so they know where they originated from so they can speak out proudly for their own hometown.